Welcome everybody. I'm gonna turn this down a little. Sorry. Um, we are playing a part two of uh, Broke Protocol Online City RPG. The last time I called it the wrong name twice. I I'm not too proud of that. So yeah. Uh, now there are different things here you will see. These are the official servers, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to start with this one, show you guys what I've done, what I've learned how to do in the game, and uh, at least try to get a job in it, because that, that's pretty nice to do. Let's get a dog up here for a minute here. Come on. Come on up. Come on. Look, guys. It's the dog. You remember him. I promise you we do have another dog, really. I know you, you haven't seen it, but we do. Now you'll see here it says paramedic. If I hit this button, oh, I was, off. I was in front of there, that is me. You can hit uh, the button there, by the way, is C. I think this is my apartment. This is my apartment. So you can actually buy things. The way you do a lot of this stuff now, from buying and all that, uh, and a lot of servers is to press the middle mouse button, pick what you want, and then press middle mouse button again. Uh, I find it quicker than pressing F for a lot of stuff. One thing I will tell you guys now, do not ever, ever, and I am not, I cannot stress this enough, you will want to press F though and click a bind key to get the things he's using a job, like see I'm a paramedic, so I want to heal him. You see how his, the names over their heads are teal. They're not teal, and they're like yellow, or even lighter, like green. They need healing. And you saw I made 200, 400 for that. Now a chat command I will teach you all is slash ATM. It doesn't always work, but when it does, it's worth it. You will see there, I'm dumping lots of money into this. There is a naked ass guy there. Uh, but since nobody has any sort of dangly bits, this is fine for YouTube. Um, I don't even know what's going on in the city. Now, different servers, you're gonna you're gonna find that you can get money off of that. There you go. I healed you. Do whatever you can to stop the gang violence as your mayor. I need you to resuscitate and help people. For your efforts, I will give you a whole seventeen dollars. You are all right. Just look out, because I think this guy was trying to box you. I don't know. Um, the, the request, the dude, I can't even understand what this guy's saying to me. I appreciate it, and if you ever watch this video, buddy, I'm not trying to be rude to you. I literally just have no idea what you're trying to say. <laughs> this got wailed by a car. That's cute. Suitcases, you press up on, you can take things, take food, guys. If you can get food, take food. Uh, moonshine, you can probably sell. Weapons, you can sell. And as you see, there are a lot of trolls, but you're going to get a lot of trolls either way. Thank you, sir. Um, I... I'm going to show you basically how to go about it. When you start a server, a lot of them will give you like anywhere from a hundred to a grand to play with to start. So you will click enter, you will talk to Forrest, and you will get stuck to be a paramedic. Uh, now I'm not going to talk to Forrest because of the reason that if you talk to somebody after you get a job, you'll cancel out your job. I learned that the hard way, don't do that. Now you'll see there too that says paramedic one. Uh, the highest you can be, so far at least, in a job is a three of any kind. Now I got my first money because I had died earlier on the server, I, you all remember, uh, quite a bit. I actually looted a guy who had a bunch of, we'll just say paraphernalia on him, so I looted it. 
And then uh, Soda Cube guy who gave me quite a bit more money than it was worth. Just I think I guess he just had a big bank account. Wanted to be nice. Um, so I began healing people, and then from there, that yeah, looks like crazy town going on there. And then from there, I learned how to do things like the ATM command. Now, not every server has this. You may have to walk your butt to the ATM, but even if you die, the money in your ATM is saved. So lesson one, get a job. Lesson two, save, save, save. Because even if I die and I need to go and re-get, and if you die, you don't need to get your job again. If you get arrested, you do. But you know, it makes sense. You get arrested in real life, you're going to lose your job. That's just, that's a fact of life, kids. Now see, for me, this is a win-win. Because I can kind of just walk around, heal Vincent here, and that's instant money. I can look around and see if he has anything I want, which he has some money. He has some of this. So we're going to take that. He's got weapons. Have fun. And they're none the wiser as to what I took. Uh, backers apparently got that cool uh, letter jacket. And there's a lot of voting. Usually if it says to kick somebody, there's a reason. So I'll normally vote yes to kick them. Um, I love the military tank just driving down the street casually. That's two. Now you can be a cop. You go to the police station for that one. You can go uh, if you don't want to break more laws. Let me, let me show you how this works here, guys. Let's look out for this taxi driver because I think he is high as a kite. Alright, the taxi driver is a job too. I think the strip club bouncer is a job too. Although, honestly, you don't really need it, because there's nothing really to do there. Um, there is a burger place on the map, too, that you can get. I will buy a cookie here and there. Um, I like to buy a bottle of water, too, and then an energy drink. And yeah, it's spending a little money, but look, it keeps you alive, alright? Now, you're going to have trolls on every server, just be aware of that. I'm eating like crazy right now because you can see there I'm still a little hungry for the num nums. So let me show you one of the most important keys. Why would you restrain me? I, I heal people. I he heal people. Stop trying to restrain me, you dick. I heal people. And you're on YouTube. We're fighting the power here. This guy just literally punched a cop. So now these two are gonna be out. Now, the reason I'm verbal about that isn't to bitch or be whiny, it's so that people are aware uh, who that could be. Like that one, I don't really care. I got murdered in jail, it happens. I'm a citizen because I'm out of jail now. So let me show you all how this works. You hit M, there's your map. This is the most valuable thing you will find. 
I'm not kidding you. You see these here, these cafes? You want to stuck up at some food? You go here. The yellow are apartments. There's one way back there near that purple. You'll see that's mine. So step one, when you can get yourself a place, step two, buy a safe, a cabinet, some piece of furniture to store your stuff in. And the reason for that is because you're gonna you're gonna want to do that. Um, three. If you've been in prison, lose your prison clothes, man. Just it don't look good. Even if you're just running around in kicks, which I am. Um, what we're gonna do here is talk to uh, let's check my ATM balance. Say, eh? I got enough. I'm gonna buy some food from Rocky, and again, shop. You can do a hands up. I don't really recommend it. It's a burger meal or a burger wrapped. I like to do the burger wrapped takeaway bags. I buy burger meals. I'll buy. The reason for all this is that we are going to be stocking our fridge. No. We're going to be stocking our fridge with all this stuff that we can. Alright. So right now, first things first, we're going to exit. We are going to make our way on the map. You can take a look at those small mini-map too as you go, guys. And uh, I hope I'm not out of focus, actually. It just dawned on me that I probably look horribly out of focus to you guys because of that. Could you not? Please. I just got nailed by a friggin' cop earlier. Somebody... Thank you, man. The guy was an ass. Okay. So like I said, you're gonna run across some major assholes here. That's inevitable. Uh, I don't really know what the heck the bouncer job does. I don't think anything huge. I am trying to find the apartment place near the pizza place. I believe it is down here more. So we're going to go dump off all my food there quickly, I hope. But again, I don't really care because... You lose money, you make money. Yes, it's sort of a pain because there are an unusual number of trolls on this. Uh, but it's a main server. So, you know, you can also make your own servers and not have to deal with some of these idiots. I don't mind dealing with the idiots because I'm used to games like this, so... Anyways... Black shirts of the city. I come to you to, among to you to look you firmly in the eyes. <laughs> well, I don't really need to go back to my apartment at this point because there's nothing there uh, for me to get. So what I'm going to do instead is heal a bunch of people, keep putting the money away that I lost, make it back, and then from there we will link. I'll grab that. Um, we will come around 
around here. Yeah, I mean, there's there's a criminal element to this game. There's a calf element. I feel like the calf element... I feel like there isn't much incentive to be a decent calf in this game. So, roleplay element-wise, I feel like they should do a little more than they're doing. Alright. So, you're going to actually see me in real time now. Go ahead and get my job as a paramedic. So I need 590 to start. So we'll draw that. We'll get job. And voila. Now I'm dressed as a paramedic. Was that really necessary? Well, on the plus side, smells basically just help me sell the trip to having to go to that. Now, bandages are what you start with as a normal paramedic. You want to get rid of these as quickly as possible and go get yourself a needle. Um, you can earn enough money as a paramedic to go buy a needle, or you can hang around and wait for a paramedic to die inevitably and steal the needle. I'm not going to lie, most most people I know that play this just wait for the paramedic to die and steal the needle. Um, even I do it, let's be honest. But right now we're just trying to make that money. So there is my apartment complex. There is a pizza place. We've made a suggestion, by the way, that we are hoping they will take, which is now. Uh, one eats in there now. Okay. That the pizza place will eventually <laughs> let you, uh, I'm on if you talk to the pizza guy, you will end up with a job there. And anytime you get a new job, you can't sell the job you had. So be aware of that too before you start getting too adventurous with that My stuff. You want to make sure that you make money. Yeah, this is PG1, they say. But if you've heard any of the language, then you know it's not PG-1. Uh, it's supposed to be PG-1. I feel like there definitely needs to be a mod or two on this thing. Um, somebody to keep the, the spirit of roleplay alive. Something, I don't know. Because I really don't see a lot of people that are playing this in a PG manner. But let's be honest, it's a lot like uh, a lot of the games this is a little derivative of, like Grand Theft Auto. No one plays that to not steal a car. Now when you start off, you're going to see people with guns, you're going to see lots of people. It depends on the server, some servers are better than others about how you do things. We're starting off on what I know a bit about, I'm doing things, and then we're going to go to a completely new server, make a new game, and we're going to figure out how hard it is, actually, to start off from scratch with just our wits, our charm, and hopefully... Nothing else. Clearly, though, there are a bunch of little assholes out right now. Um, but you know, it happens. I'm not too bummed by it because, like I said, this game, on occasion you end up going, like, really? Really? You also had to take it as a grain of salt and realize that this is what this is, and it's just one of these games that you learn to like even the most annoying troll, because at the end of the day, the whole game is just entertaining and silly and has fun moments. Um, I do think the job thing, they, sh they need to work in a little more security with it. Sort of a pain. Good example is as a... 
Paramedic Jughead incidents where my guy has inadvertently ended up. Um. Being damaged when. Or not damaged, but uh, I I've gotten thrown in jail for accidentally hurting somebody when I did not mean to. So that has happened. If you're not sure where to find people to heal, wander around because even if they are NPCs, you will still make money. And uh, you want that. Obviously, to do your job, that pizza man there just totally bit the side of the building. Uh, now, as you see, I've earned quite a bit in this game, so I'm not too fussed about dying here and there. It doesn't bother me too bad. It happens, it happens. Like, see, it happens. There is actually in this game as well an offline mode. Now since I played this before, um, this game is not free anymore. It was free for the first hundred hours if you didn't get it done. It's still a fair price. It's only five bucks. I think that's a decent price for what you get. And more updates are coming, so I'm curious to see. But I will say it's more polished than quite a few that I've seen like this, so... Uh, you all just witnessed a hit and run right there. You see that, guys? You saw it here first, people. Remember that. Oh no, I'm really trying to get... Hey, hold on, hold on, buddy. Hold on. Let me, uh, let me heal you. Hold on, let me heal you. Okay. I was trying to heal him, but... The cop just whacked him upside the head, so I don't think I'm healing him now. Police brutality. People driving aircraft and bombing people. This place is crazy, this city. Um, yeah, bandages kind of suck when you start, but when you go up in the paramedic world, you get better equipment. So, chin up, people. Let's stick with it. Like I said, you follow enough people, and you will find a needle for free, usually. And the moment you do, you want to grab that thing like it's gold, because they are, for some of you, defending. This is an ATM in the game. If your server does not allow the slash ATM command, get to them as much as you can and put your money in them. Wait, wait, I'm trying to heal you. Yeah, you're welcome. Thinkless. It's a thinkless job, I'm telling you. Although I do not complain too much because honestly when you start to do good and you're a paramedic level 3 you're making like 300 bucks a pop just to heal somebody and you can sink that in. Like I have two other people that I am going to be playing this with. Probably four. Sardis is one of them that plays on, uh, that has played this with me. We were goofing around. We didn't know how to get a job. Now that I know, I'm going to fund his 
entry into the job world. So you can start making some money. Get a bank account going. Because honestly, once you get a rhythm of a few hundred bucks in this, you can make about a grand in this, then as long as you are smirk and don't act like a jerk to everybody, you can kind of get by. Alright. As you see, I'm just kind of wandering the city leisurely. I I need to get a few more bandages here, guys. Um, wandering the city leisurely, and then from there, doing what I gotta do now. Uh, somebody asked me, actually, on uh, Steam, what the heck the things that I had. Officer, let me heal you. Hold on, hold on, hold on. There you go, sir. Um, but you see, healing him helps me out too, because then we get experience, and we want that. You'll see hands up, because you can rob. I try not to. Now I have the exact number of these I need. These do restock, by the way. I don't know how long it takes them to restock. I don't know if I gotta like go out and come in or put us to come in. So we're gonna leave. I'm gonna test this area right now on Let's Play. Let's see if I come back in. Oh god, what did I do? I just accidentally stole a computer display. I didn't mean to steal that. No one's gonna know. I hope. Yeah, you, you have that. I don't want that. What in the hell did I walk out to here? Look at all this, guys. It's just <laughs> it's a pizza truck. You can be a pizza delivery guy. Um, one suggestion I had that I'm really hoping they take into consideration is I think it'd be fun if you could be any kind of clerk. You know what I mean? Like, just let people be clerks, man, everywhere. I'm taking all of this stuff, all of it, all of it. And we are getting out of the way right now. And we are just running straight to our apartment before I do a damn thing. Because I just got rid of furniture, I got something uh, worth some money, so I want it. We're cutting through the alley, we're going in here, we're almost home for you guys, can we make it? Or some idiot tries to kill us, let's see. You're all set. Okay, now I'm in. And when you're in your place, you're in a safe place. It sounds funny, but it's true. So, uh, yeah, now let me show you out here. <laughs> uh, so this is my little safe. You're going to hit... Uh, view items, so you can hit F. So I just click remove all to dump this stuff in the safe. Uh, as you see, I actually have a surprising little arsenal there. Uh, now this thing I can put in my place. If I, apparently I want to be Walter White or something. Uh, you know what, we're gonna. Why not? I already bought it and I clicked it. What are you talking about? I don't understand what happened there. Oh, right, 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 because I already, I already own it, so... All I really need to do is find a key for it, so let's hit 2. And then, uh, boom. I am now the only medic I know who has a functional meth lab. I don't know why I have one, but I have one. Alright, I don't judge. Um, but that was a good haul there with the weaponry that I just got, because that, that stuff is not cheap. We're also going to dump all my money right now in there. Because um, I don't trust if the streets were getting a little sketchy out there. And as you all saw, I, w I made more than enough 
to make back the few deaths I had. That's what I was saying in this game. Now we're gonna go through here. Let's see if I talk to Dwayne. Don't do it, because you will become a pizza man. If you want to be a pizza person, go talk to Dwayne. But if you do not, or you're trying to do something else, then don't bother. Um, I have also heard... Oh. Hey, don't hit me, I'm just healing people. You want healed? Wait, stand still, I'll heal you. And I'm hoping if I'm right to that my next one I get Alright, see. I get a defibrillator. Thank you. You can do it! I believe in you. Thank you. I have no idea why this got shot. But I appreciate your help. Uh, so yeah, this is not probably the safest area to be doing this in, but yeah. So anyways, as you go up in level, you will get new toys and new things. But thank you, sir. I appreciate it. There is a hospital that I supposedly work at. Uh, don't steal, don't take cop cars unless you want your ass busted. And I cannot stress that enough. Um, I'm going now. Eh. Take a banana and eat for now. I'll try and stock my food the second time. If I can. Before I even take the money out, I'm just gonna kinda see how I feel people are on the street because I don't want to lose a bunch of money again. So I'm just feeling this out right now. I feel like they're being too sketchy. I'm not even bothering. And as you see, more than one of you can loot a crate. So if you see something you want, you have a chance of getting shot less if you don't steal everything out of the crate and leave something for somebody else. But a lot of times it just depends. And as you can see there are battle royales on the server. So now I've given you some tips to survive the city a little more, this crazy city. Uh, so what do you say, let's go here in the hospital, I'll deal with trying to stuff my fridge another time. We're gonna go in into the hospital here, hang out, and uh, I will disconnect from the server, and we're gonna start from scratch on a server we haven't been on. And we're gonna make that the, the end of the rest play, the dog wants down, so the dog's gonna get down. Uh, so let's see here, what do we have? We have, I've been on that one. Now these four servers all connect to the same thing. Now Moonshade Gaming has zero people. So that's not going to be very fun for a video, is it? Last word of Eden. The ping is not too bad. It has 11, so it's a manageable thing. I think they're crazy making the max that they made. Um. Some of these let you be a grandpa too, which I think is funny. You can also be a hostess, housewife, hipster. I am not going to be a hipster. Uh, a hipster. <laughs> a tourist. We'll be a tourist. You know, let's be. Let's surprise people. We'll be a grandpa. 
will be a grandpa. Blackbeard. We need the ground suspenders. We're doing old school grandpa here. Gotta have patch ground pants. What is this? Come on. Uh, I feel like grandpa wears brown shoes. No gloves. He's grandpa. So this is my first time on the server. This is an example. So we'll see if we start with money. If not, we are going to do something that I normally don't do, which is we're going to try to panhandle. Okay. We start with money. So let's check out the map. Now this place here has some sort of uh, service. I think I can be a taxi driver if I want. Uh, yeah, let's try something different, guys. What do you say? So let's get a job as a taxi driver. So I got a driver's license right off the bat, and now I can uh, I can go places as a taxi driver. That's what I do. I'm a taxi guy. I don't know how to. I don't know what I'm doing, but I know one thing. Uh, this should be good comedy. Right away, Sonny! I had to right away! <laughs> Does anybody need a taxi? Do you need a taxi? Do you need a taxi, sir? Does anybody need a taxi? Come in. I will drive you someplace. Where do you need to go? Come on, you young whippersnappers. Who needs a job? Who needs a taxi? Kirk! Kirk! Do you need a taxi, Kirk? Let's All these young whiffer snippers. I got the right away, Sonny. Don't cut an old man off. What the hell's a hospital? Oh my god, I'm going the wrong way. Alrighty, who am I picking up here? Uh, 
Hey, how are you? Where do you need to go? Um, take me uh, away, away from here, quick. Uh, I will take you away. Would you like to go? We'll go into the city a bit. You need to. You need to get away from people. Can you uh, take me to the airport real quick? Yes. Let me look that up. We'll go to the airport right now. Turn on this newfangled GPS you kids are using. Would you like to buy some uh, wheat? You can uh, buy it off me and sell it to someone else if you want. I heard about that there stuff. They say that's good for the glaucoma. Yeah. All right. Oh god, this cop is a jerk. What was that? Okay. These youngins don't know how to drive. Out of the way, people. We got right away here. This is back country. Come on, I got a passenger. You sons of bitches. They need to get to the airport. Pronto. You see the cop jump out in front of me? Listen, I'm driving fine. My my bifocals are a little messed up today, but we'll, we'll be alright. Don't worry. Officer, take that away from me. I'm an old man. No, 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 no. Yes, do not point that at me, son. Stop. Oh, you. Stop, 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 stop. I don't like the look of these fellas. They're youngins. They're probably in a gang. Get out of the vehicle. They're probably in a gang, those kids. You know they are. We can't stop there. Yeah. Alright, where the hell is the airport? Well, you want to go to the military base, you're saying? Okay, that I can do. I know where that is. Yeah, that guy just jumped right out in front of us. Well, I don't even know. Listen, everything's a road to me. <laughs> Hey, buddy! Hey, get out of the way, pal! Hey, what are you doing to my passenger? What are you doing to my passenger? Leave him alone. Get over here! You don't mess up my passenger! No, you messed up! I will do the fisticuffs with you, pal! I am old man winter! Oh, that is it! My heart medicine! What have you done? These people are crazy! Look at that cop there! I think they're on that there ecstasy I keep hearing about, that you youngins do. Hey, you're not too bad at this, son. You should get a job doing a taxi driver. Ignore the smoke in the car, that just means it's working. Stop the taxi. No. No. Run it. It's the popo, run. What are you running? Marathopedics! What did you do to me, cop? Freeman! That's because of the fact that the. the oh no, you don't! I'm in jail now, am I? Let me tell you, young and so we used to do a pick in the day. There, now I'm tougher than the rest of them. You get away from me, Sonny. Did you come near me with those cuffs? That was a numb. I'm going to take on me now. Oh, wait. 
I was in Vietnam. Don't you you get away from me, Carmen? I I really I really like this song. It sounds good. Mine in the way. I don't know what's going on. Mine in the way. In this Minecraft game. What is this new thing of music you're listening to? Put on some Bunny Goodman, son. Put on some Frank Sinatra. I don't feel so good. <laughs> now I'm just a lonely, old, lonely old man. Who literally has, uh, what do I have to myself? I have a driver's license. Most servers will not have you lose your license. Um, I hope you all are not offended by my old man voice. I know that's not how old men really speak normally, but I I'm just doing the most stereotypical old man I can. It here's what I love. Nobody's even picking up the old man shtick. That or they're just not into it. I don't know. I find it funny. Just to be the confused old man around the server. Pardon me, gentlemen. Either one of you know the way to the YMCA. Jeez, I don't think he's walking that off. There you go, buddy. You're all free. Go and enforce the law, sir. And keep the city safe. I'm just looking around at stuff. I'm just gonna sit on my porch and eat my apple. Hi, how are you? Okay, stop squaring off with me, fella. I'm like 90. Get a grip. Thank you there, sir. These youngins today, let me tell you. Back when I fought in the Great Mushroom Wars, you should have seen all this trouble. Me and Finn, and this guy named uh, Ice King, it was, it was crazy. Let's be a drunk old man, because that will be fun. Oh my god, look at this, guys. <laughs> Officer! Officer! How are you? How are you today, sir? What the hell? Get out! I can be a fireman in this. All right, that could be fun.
Okay, so fireman is only 2 or something. That's not too shabby. I bet we can come up with that. Hey! Does anybody want to hear a joke? Joke for a little money. Joke for a little money. And saving to get a job in this here town. Uh, so basically, what have we learned playing this so far? Be wise enough to pick a good job. Is that you there, Chester? How are you? Been a while since I've seen you. Okay, a guy walks into a bar and he sets a uh, duck on the stool next to him. And this other guy is drunk and he's sitting there looking at him, he's looking at the pig, he's looking at him, he's looking at the pig. Oh, you know what? I screwed that whole joke up. I haven't been right since now. Just give me like a, a little money and I'll be alright, buddy. I'm just trying to get a job around here. Either it's a fireman or something, I don't know. Thank you, sir. Thank you. I found the Great Mushroom War. You want to help me rob uh, the gun store? Not really, do you want to rob the gun store and do the handcuffing? I just wanted to grab any clothes I could. You want these? <laughs> That's okay. I just feel like having a, an old man running around butt naked is not a good idea in this city, let me tell you. I think it's a great idea. Oh, damn. Holy jeepers! What happened there? You're gonna want this, son. This guy's got one of them zappy dappy things. Over, over here in this suitcase, he had a zappy dappy thing. It was amazing. Now come on now buddy, I'm just trying to earn a living. Everybody's working for the weekend.
Everybody, do 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 do. I was in the Great Mushroom War, people. Some of you out there have to know what that is. Come on now. So, all right, so this is your expiration. I have a key witness. Oh, I didn't get much money, did I? I actually thought I... Oh, I did get some money. Um, so I am not disguised. So we need to change my outfit here. So let's drop these. We are going to see if it's possible, guys, to hold out, basically, and see if we can survive long enough to beat my crime. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? we got two minutes left on it. Can we do it? Can we go and get legitimate? We literally robbed the hospital we're getting ready to go back and try and work at. Can we do it? As some old ass man, can it happen? I don't know. I don't know. Let's see how much time we have. We are told everybody about our exploits uh, as uh, when we fought in the Great Mushroom War. This is not our usual server. Uh, I wanted to try and show you guys just kind of how the game worked more. Now that I've learned, I promise you guys, I do another Let's Play if I learn how to get a job and do all this other stuff in it. So now I know how to do that. Uh, now I'm trying to wait for this little star to disappear. You can see it in the lower left-hand corner there. On the map, there is a star. So when that vanishes, I guess my time is gone. Uh, come on now, man. It's been at least three minutes, so it should not take much longer, but nobody seems to be back here near this area of the house. Let's look at the home. I love that right there, too. It's got a huge, huge thing. Now, Spec Ops is apparently a job you can get. I didn't really care for Taxi Driver. Um, that might be up in some of your alleys. Just was not mine. There's also bosses in the places. I don't know what they do yet. Uh, there's a dealer of sorts. There are different sorts of apartment places. There's delivery jobs, taxi jobs, spec op jobs. So I can go where the tank is, but I feel like as an old man, I don't really want to do that. Um, again, the easiest money for me, for, for my advice to you all so far, is just frankly, if you don't know what else to do, you're not sure, go off. And, uh, I'm going to be sneaky here. Instead of just sitting on our ass and waiting, let's see if we can sneak past people. Alright, I did it. I think we are officially cleared of our crimes. No crimes, no eyewitnesses. So we did good. So now, we are just going to sit there. We're going to run to the hospital. Oh, we're definitely taking that. Um, he has a business jacket. And he has uh, black pants. So... Let's at least put those on so we look a little presentable, shall we? There, we got our hat on, so we're good to go there. And now we are going to go and march up and try and get a job. Um, at the hospital, I see it. It's in our sights. This is kind of nervous. I'm not going to lie to y'all. I'm both excited and nervous, guys, because I could waltz in there and get it, or I could not. I don't know yet. So let's see. And again, doing both on the same server, yes, it's sort of lame, I know, but again, this is just trying to show you guys how to do this, run you guys through it one last time. So, boom! We are now legit. 
We are now a jet, just that easy. We have become a non, uh, non-criminal citizen, where we started as criminals, and now we are good to go. So, uh, we have done that now, guys. So, our mission to go from Popper, where we had nothing, and, uh, instead to be a viable member of society has paid off for now, and now we look like we are good. Uh, there we go. We're even earning some money right there, just for helping Rocky out, so... We're gonna go... Shop for some more of these. Get them. Um... Probably buy all of them. And we're gonna start. Just as easy, guys. Same command, slash ATM. And put our first 300 in the bank. Boom. Now I don't know if I ever play on the server again or not. This is basically just to show you guys how to get started. Now again, you don't gotta do this job. Do whatever job you like. This was just an introduction on how to go from... Uh, and again, if I were to pick like Fireman or something off the bat, I'd be fine. That's just to show you how to get a job. Keep making money, keep putting it away. When you get an apartment, I will tell you guys a tip you need to know, and that's it. You'll click a little button in front of one, and you can click a buy. You need to be looking at the door. If you don't, it won't let you buy it. So that's just a little pro tip for you. You guys enjoy. Uh, I am Bones. I am going to disconnect here. I honestly don't even remember what server that is. I think they need to add devs. You need to add a favorites thing, too, would be good. But anyways, so I am uh, Bones. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Broke Protocol Online City RPG. I'll have the link below. It's $4.99. It's cheaper than buying yourself fast food. I recommend you pick it up. It's a neat little game. And uh, we are done, so be sure to subscribe, like, you guys have a great day.